All right, hi there. City Skylines speedrun with only one mod, unlimited money. Nice for time saving. So, I already played this one and now I'm recording it and splitting it with you together. I gave it 20 tries the last days. This is my best one. I think there are a lot of things which worked quite well and some things I can approve. Let's have a look. Normal start, bits of support for the first buildings with energy there, a little bit of change to the other ones. Mm, unlimited money, preparing very fast the water lines. And now I'm expanding for the first milestone that I can put a lot of schools and healthcare centers to boost empty areas. Also, I hope I'm building the south side where I can build the first garbage. Should be ready when the first milestone hits the 320. Oh, we can see in the north zones and they're empty. That's why I want to boost them. For that, I need the 320 people. But quite nice. Everybody, everything is set up for the first milestone. Also a nice time. Usually I do this with parks, but parks are coming with the next milestone and I got unlimited money. That's what I can use them as parks. Nice taxes to the lowest point, 1%. Budget increase for all the things I can build for now. Nice, I've remembered everything from the checklist. Yeah, I gave it a lot of tries. I uh, think it's it has a definitely a snowball effect. If you got a good start and got the good new buildings a little bit faster, every milestone which is coming next comes faster. So next milestone, police and fire. Also you using them to give the people the in initiative to Move in the empty zones. Nice to have so much money. Yeah, I want to finish this block with the next milestone. There's coming high school and libraries. Also very good buildings. To increase land value and make people happy and bring them to move into the empty areas. Oh, that was fast. I like it. Beautiful. High schools, libraries, and the first parks. Let's have a look on my checklist. Have I played it well? I think I increased the budget also and pushed the policy for parks. But not a big difference maker. We can see I have to expand, expand, expand. Much more to do than in a normal speed run. Okay. I think power is solved for now. What comes with the next milestone? 
Ah, oh, Schaltcare, Elder Care. Yep, budget. So that's the biggest problem with speedruns with unlimited money. You always forget something. But in this one, I'm happy. Didn't forget a thing for now. Well, I think that's for that's it for now. West side expansion is prepared. I think the next zones uh, okay, last zones here. The next zones are coming with five thousand five point five thousand. I think I can start expanding to the east. Hmm, perfect timing. With 1.8. Oh yeah, elder care, child care. And cemetery for dead people. But also you get with 1.8 the possibility to connect to the highway. Let's start the East Expansion. I think for now I can ignore the West side. I think everything is prepared. A lot of support buildings. Now I'm taking my time with the east side. And nice grown numbers. Falling under 200 was for the longest time over there. Oh, okay. Was lying. I still have to support the west side. Yeah, some more schools. Let's start the east side expansion. I have to build the first road in the middle of nowhere because when I'm building it too close to the highway the roads are usually fucking up and you can't zone it fast enough that way it's perfect I'm not losing time with zoning So east side expansion should be ready before the next milestone. Energy ready. Time for water. And I hope I remembered to build some water pumps after supporting this area. milestone coming up. Finally you can switch streets with the better ones with the trees. Nice. Also with 3.6 thousand uh, I get the big fire department and police department. Nice. I remembered making people much more happy. And I hope after that I build the water pumps so I can support the whole city. What we see past Ibu is not lazy. He has so much to do. But 
I think water has to be next. Come on, now the water. Sweet. Yeah. 10,000 more. Wastewater. And the capacity would be full. Sweet timing. So now I'm preparing everything for 5.5. These zones are getting higher residential. Preparation for the office zones. And all these little roads to the north uh, are the preparation for garbage collection later on when a lot of people are moving here. I'm not only want to build the streets in the west and the east for the next uh, zones, I also want to build the support buildings. All of the old support buildings should be already in place. Close call. Got a lot of to got a lot to do. Got a lot to do. Yeah, 5.5 is the uh, most busiest part. The new zones are coming, and uh, also uh, you want to reduce the taxes. And a lot of policies are coming. You can also push people uh, with. Um, the taxation. I hope I remember it all. So here we go 5.5 .5. and also university. Nice, I remembered them. Okay, first the east. High commercial separated from the high de residential with office zones. Nice. And I only got two hands. I want to expand in the west. Okay, so that's also nice. If it goes fast. Uh, one zone is empty. But I got no time. Oh, but it looks okay. At least some support buildings uh, are up there in the west. So, taxes, policy, and taxation, still to do, or well, still on the bucket list. Taxes, nice. Step by step policy and taxation, sweet. Nice segment. Yeah, I really wanted to beat the 40 minute mark. And I think in this one I'm cutting eight days from my personal best, which is strange. Eight days uh, with a normal setting shouldn't be uh, t 10 seconds, much more seconds safe. But it's a problem I uh, already worked out in one of my videos that the time isn't the same for in-game days later on, even with my new PC. Yeah, really nice segment. Switched a lot of zones, built the new zones, supported everything. Didn't forget the water, didn't forget the electricity. That's a gold.
but it looks good. It's very normal that you forget something totally, but in this run, fire, police, leisure, and the whole education and healthcare thing, nice. I'm not sure if I built uh, public transportation in this run. In the other runs I tried it. With very fast bus stops placing and uh, making people happy around them. I liked it, but it wasn't a big, big time save or whatever went wrong in the other parts of the runs. I think this in this my best run I don't incorporate bus stops. But I really can and should. As I get faster and faster and faster with the whole building and building stuff. And I think it, now we are now 16 minutes in the run and past Ibu didn't take a break. Doing, doing, doing stuff. This one looks really good. Didn't even take a break after finishing the whole support stuff. Expanding to the north. Ah, I think I can save some time if I build the water pipes for the west side also in one move. Zooming out. But what I said earlier. It's not that there's lazy parts, or there are not, not many lazy parts. Okay, that should do it, garbage man. Looks fine. A lot of empty space between the nice support buildings. Where are we at? Two hundred thousand dollars a week minus. The people should love it. Hmm. Time for North Expansion number two. Already planned in my head. Yeah, building near the highway usually a successful strategy. A little bit surprised what's happening on the west side there, but... Well, it's a speed run sometimes. It doesn't look pretty. Okay, bit of confusion there, but... If you think I build a lot of parks, I think I can build more parks. These little empty zones, well, empty areas uh, in the zones. I think there's no problem if you build more parks. Until they can't breathe anymore. Because of the 
number of parks. Bad wording. Yeah, from now on there are coming no new buildings. I've got all I need from university to the big healthcare, childcare, elder care. I hope I don't miss the kind of support building. Well, but pretty nice. I even remembered to put the cemetery out there. I missed some milestone. Yeah, didn't even see the zone on the left side. Still empty. Got no time to check the whole city. These problems will occur. Yeah, I think I will find it difficult to return to my normal runs. I'm really interested in pushing the time lower on two rivers. But the last two weeks I played only unlimited mode and what shall I say? It's pretty nice to have some money at your hands. Expanding to the end. Until the end. I really don't see I get time for demolishing abandoned buildings. Still got a lot to do. But generally, I'm pretty happy with her placement of the roads. Mm -hmm. And I jinxed it, now I'm getting lazy. But if you get uh, a little bit off with the ankle of one street, it's usually a big time loss because you have to manually fill the zones and can't brush them with one. Little motion.
it's getting to the point where I'm exhausted. Building for 25 minutes straight. Concentration. Well, I'm losing a bit of my focus. I hope I build more parks. Okay, a bit of power problem on the west side. It's okay if the background is white, but if it's uh, changing to the red one, like we are seeing here, that's a bit too late. So this time I'm splitting on the right time. 24,000, 26 minutes, nice time. Losing a bit of time. Oh, a bit of blindness. The north area has power problems and I don't see them. Also, there's a zone in the south side I didn't even fill with high residential. Too much to do. Yeah, these tunnels are really, really expensive, but I think it solves the whole the traffic problem. I get four connections with tunnels, four connections with uh, bridges, and the whole highway in the middle. I don't think traffic is my problem. only minor hiccups. Oh, if I remember correctly, uh, I should have built a little bit of garbage uh, in the north side. Way is too long to the garbage facility in the middle. But they're not living so many people. Doesn't make a big difference. Yeah, but really happy with the support buildings. I'm not missing anyone. Also schools, high schools, university, public library, check mark, healthcare, a lot, check, fire, police, nice, whole cemetery stuff, check. What am I missing? Yeah, a lot of parks and some more. I'm a bit pissed about the zone on the left side, which is still empty. I don't think I'm seeing it. Well, he's not seeing it, it's a past Ibu. 
Yeah, I try to run uh, with commentating while playing and... Uh, that's not mine. I mean, I got problems commentating it uh, when I'm not playing right now. You make the math. Oh, next split's coming up. 600 people per week. Nice numbers. Crushing the Biffa challenge, by the way. And again, a time loss. Garbage is solved. Water is solved. I think we're getting to the point where I can build the bus stops, which I didn't incorporate in this one, but there's a time for that. And I can destroy abandoned buildings. First time in a run that I can... Okay, already. Uh, I have to expand it. But after this expansion, I think... I have the first moment in the run where I got time for destroying buildings. And potential bus stops. Yep, checking, but... Everything is built. Only more parks. Overall, a very nice run. Nice, 850 people moving in per week. 900. Boom. Breaking 1000. Yes. That's really rare on Blackwood. Best education town in the whole world. I'm looking and looking and I can't criticize so much. I think more parks, I've got the time for it. A bit more abandoning uh, or demolishing of the abandoned buildings. But the whole support building thing, check, check, check. I don't know if this expansion is necessary. I think I can uh, 
from this point on only support the zones I got. Oh, nice. Garbage boost. I'm not seeing the electricity problem in the middle. Oh, okay. I'm seeing it. I think it's better if I build the bus stations with this time on my hands. I don't know, for sure. Can't say he's lazy, he's doing stuff. But I think the bus stops and the fast building of bus stops and the bus depots. A little bit better at this point. Hmm. But what I said earlier, I gave it a lot of tries and this is my best one. If I get a good start like this again. And then I want to incorporate the bus stops and fill our, fill our zones. Still got this empty zone on the east side. Wow, 1000. Okay, can't say anything. These numbers are superb. Ah, I can't get my mind right. The demolishing of the abandoned buildings definitely support for the growth numbers. I mean, it's definitely my best run. I'm cutting eight days in game, but even are the uh, even if these numbers are so big with a weekly increase, I think I'm losing a bit of time to my other record. Because the in-game dengue length is changing. Man, I really wanted a time under 40 minutes. Yeah, but really, really nice run. On every milestone, I remembered um, my checklist. Did it as fast as possible. The only thing uh, I can criticize, I should build a bit more parks and the whole bus stop thing if I get faster and got a lot more of time. But I think there is time for building bus stops and maybe an airport on the east side. And this one zone, my god. I mean, it's a prime zone and nobody can move there.
Yep. Really good run. Yeah, but I think I will try my normal speedruns in the next week. Trying to get two rivers under 52 minutes. Or maybe unlimited two rivers, but... I think Blackwood's unlimited. That's it for now. Boom! 40 minutes, 15 seconds. And 968 in-game days, if I calculate it right. And ooh, land value. Rich, rich, rich. 500,000 per week minus. Richy rich. Yeah. I'm happy with the run. If you're still watching at this point, I wish you a good day. Bye.